Recode access. Purchase recode access token. Hold on. What is going on, guys? The new recode for COS has just dropped. Um, It's only the beta, though, but that doesn't mean that we cannot access it. And we're going to check it out right now. All right. So upon joining, it looks pretty much the same. What? What? What is this? Limited spin gotcha. All right. Oh, okay. So upon buying the recode token, you will be given in the main game a Miju Miju Suima, which is a very cool coral like creature. By the way, all of your data is going to be wiped after this recode hits public release. Um, that doesn't mean like your main stuff will be gone, like everything will be safe, just not in the beta recode. So, in here we got the missions. This is a very clean looking interface. You can also s see the missions for... Oh my god. Alright, for premium, you can buy items with Robux. However, I don't think you're... I don't think we should buy things that are gonna be wiped soon but uh yeah we also got dev creatures and very cool stuff hold on what does it say all right we got the recode supporter badge let's go all right so we also got shop which we can buy our creatures with uh, we also have time points and it looks Pretty fresh. Look at these. Look at these sprites. We got trial gotchas. We got featured. And then we got materials, plushies, palettes, tokens, all the things that we could ever wish for in COS. We also have our own inventory, which showcases all the creatures that we have here. Our currency, the amount of mushrooms, and everything we have. We have a brand new UI for the shroom converter, which is pretty nice. Oh, we have this. Let's see what we'll get. Our first... Oh, besides Root Kick. Beta release... Cre okay, we got it. And finally, we got nests. We can request to be nested as people now. We also got a new settings, and we can change a lot of things. We got camera shake, HQ lighting, blood effects, missions, camera smoothing, and item notifications. And we got the login rewards here, and we got... What is this? I don't know what that is. We also got cell species um, and view creatures in a new. <laughs> oh my god, this looks cool. We have a brand new system of looking at our creatures. And then we got a brand new trade round button, which looks pretty cool. Alright, enough rambling along. Let's go ahead and play as a creature already. Oh my goodness. The music. What is this? Carcass. Ow, Psychery. Bro, like 200 ping. Alright, so upon first glance already, I can tell that the lighting has been revamped heavily. It looks super cool. I'm super stoked at this new lighting. Um, the map completely changed, which is insane. We also got smoother animations that actually, like, adapt to the environment that you're, like, walking on. And you can also, like, cling on to, like, rocks and such. Oh, you also get time points over there. So, I can see people AFKing a lot for time points. And overall, new sound effects, new UI for your abilities. We got Ambush. We got invisibility and now when you turn invisible it doesn't like turn you on invisible the moment you oh my goodness wait oh my gosh they're jumping <gasps> you that's cool so i can see people like doing stuff like oh you can walk sideways Forwards, backwards, a uh, strafing. All right, pretty, pretty cool. And look at the Boreal Warden, like, it's absolutely ginormous. All right, how do I stop strafing? Oh, it's Curdle. So, 
Once you press curdle, you can strafe. Nice. We got a brand new system of drinking and eating. That is insane. Alright, so the map is supposed to be pretty huge. You can click on this to check on the map. And as you can see, it has been revamped heavily. What is that? I think that's a nest. So you can see food and plants on the map, which hasn't been like that before. You can also see other players as well. You can also show your marker to people everywhere or just your friends or pack members, which is pretty nice. Overall, I really like this. Oh, five rocks. All right, it's menuing the same. Okay, like not menu. Oh, you can check stats like this. Oh. Oh, and that's the menu button. Alright. Alright, so overall, I really like this recode. I cannot wait for the actual public release. So yeah, that was the COS beta recode sneak peek. That was amazing. I cannot wait for the official release. And um, yeah, if you enjoy this kind of content, be sure to subscribe, like, and of course, comment down below what you want to see next. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.